Explore, Dr. Stone requesting faster transport to Bay Area. Explore, do you copy? Explore, permission to retrieve Dr. Stone. Here it goes, Walker. Hi from the Gravity Junket in Los Angeles. Today is so exciting. I was just talking to Sandra Bullock about the new movie Gravity and now I'm standing next to two real life astronauts, Katie and Michael. Thank you so much for being here today. Pleasure. It's such a cool opportunity to get to talk to you. It's our pleasure. So you just saw the movie, right? How did you like it? It was awesome to go to space again without actually leaving the planet. I mean, I, I really, to me, Mike, it just looked like what we see up there. And it also, I think, makes everybody down here realize that we, people live in space right now. I mean, in the movie and also in real life. We have a space station. We're doing research up there. I trained in Köln and also Oberfaffenhofen <laughs> for my European training for the space station. And it's a 16-country it's a international team doing amazing work up there. Wow. So was there a scene that didn't feel real? Was there a scene where you thought, no, that's not how it goes? Um, well, it, I think, you know, it's a movie, right? Mm -hmm. So I think, you know, when we do our work, we're generally very, very conservative because it is very risky, which they showed in the movie, so that you, you know, you move very slowly and you're very conservative about how you move around. What some of the space walking is the way I would like to do it, but they wouldn't let me. So I was really like, fast I was glad yeah, and one thing you move flying, you're doing a lot of you want to go really slowly and very cautious so you don't break anything and if there's an emergency you can react well. But they would space walking the way I would like to. But uh, in reality, you know, we're we're a little more conservative. But it's a movie and, and I think it had so many other things. The realism of the, the the model of the Hubble looked exactly like the Hubble that I worked on and the tools they had a they had a cutter tool that I hadn't seen since I'd flown in space. And then I saw it in the movie. And it's a, like a one-of-a-kind tool that they had. Uh, so there was a lot, of, a lot of realism there that uh, brought back some great memories. So, Katie, you, get, um, you got in touch with Sandra Bullock, right? And through a very funny story, you got in touch through your families. It's true. My, fam my brother met her sister, who said, Sandy's making a movie about being an astronaut, would your sister talk to her? And my brother said, I think so. <laughs> <laughs> and it was really a neat event. I was up there for six months. Uh -huh. And so this is about three months into it. And, you know, after a little while, living with five other five guys, you know, it's, it's really nice to have a girlfriend to talk to. <laughs> and Sandra Bullock <laughs> as a girlfriend. I know. It, it, was, it was actually really neat. It's a special place that we get to be. And to be able to share with her knowing that she's making this movie that is going to enable us to share the important work we're doing and, and how amazing it is to see the earth from from that vantage point just knowing that i was helping facilitate that that was really nice for me and really fun for our crew our guys <laughs> on the on the crew would say did she ask about me <laughs> <laughs> and you were having a beer with george clooney were you no i didn't oh. but i will if he wants to <laughs> but i think he did base his character on my personality because he's really cool in the movie I love the sentence where he says, well, I think you haven't realized how good looking I am. <laughs> yeah, I mean, he didn't get that one from me, but I would, I would have given him some other lines. But no, I, I've never had it. But we think he's a cool guy. And, and uh, you know, one, one of my uh, last flights, we enjoyed, we really enjoyed watching his movies together. Some of the movies he did where it was, you know, the Oceans, Oceans movies that he did. We, we really, we liked watching them as a crew because it was like a group of, a group of people together doing a, doing a caper, you know, going, doing something risky and fun and that's what we felt our space mission was like so we've we've uh, enjoyed his work gravity is coming to the cinemas in the beginning of october be sure to check it out thank you so much guys thank, thank you, you. Pleasure. <laughs>